Hey, orange one here. So we got a little bit of an issue. Um, the Batanians, they're going down to Legata, and I think they're going to be able to hold it. Um, I'm, I'm not sure if the force that's following them is strong enough to really hold them back. This group, though... Did that say 140 prisoners? Hold on. You have 140 prisoners. You sure you want to be attacking this right now? How's your how's your siege going over here? Maybe I could just uh I kinda wanna just be a part of it, honestly. Continue the siege. Yeah, let's just wait. I'm gonna just be a part of this. Um Honestly, just because I kinda want to. Oh, we could have attacked that group of 25. Let's keep an eye out for other groups passing by like that. Um well, there's a group of 46 right there. They're kind of moving towards my party, but not really. Can I look at my party and upgrade anyone? No, I can't upgrade anyone. I think we're just healing up then. Yeah, they're they're chasing after me, but they won't attack while I'm with this this group. And I think that we'll be able to take this castle. Yeah, I'm not sure about how I feel about that guy right there we could have maybe taken him but not worth it you know you really only want to attack when you clearly have an advantage and that was not the case there that dude gonna actually run up to me no he's just kind of checking things out a little bit okay we'll speed it up we'll let things get built Yeah, it looks like the uh, enemy, they just kind of look at things. Okay, so someone's created another army. Oh. Do I dare say, should I attack it? Wait, what? What are you? Hold on. What's going on now? I'm. We're at war with all of Landia? Why? Sorry, they're at war with Vlandia. Oh god, okay, so we gotta start raiding Vlandia. There's no way that we're gonna be able to stand a war against them. Okay, um, yes, attack the caravan. I believe that we can handle a, a caravan. I could be wrong, but if I am, I need to find out because this is, uh, this is bad news for us. Which one of you is faster? You're faster. I'm gonna go after you then. We're gonna start raiding as anywhere and everywhere that we can because this is gonna be a hard fought war. If we're gonna even survive Landia, we're gonna have to fight really hard. And it's a good thing that Marinath is here because I've got a feeling they're gonna be getting a lot of stolen goods. <laughs> Let's just say that. Yeah, hand over your goods. I am not fooling around here, caravan. Um, let's see. I'm gonna just take see, over command. See what the AI does. Honestly, I'm just kind of curious what they do. Um, I mean, I know what I would do is I would hold some ground, but that looks like that's what the enemy is doing. Infantry on my flank. Cavalry. I'm actually gonna tell the cavalry to stay with me because they're gonna just run straight into arrows right now. You can almost hear the arrows coming. But we need to just get behind the units right now. That's what we need to do, is cavalry. And I'll let the archers kind of do their thing. It looks like they're already firing. Good. Looks like they've got a superior position as well, which is great. Um. They do have more archers though, so we should probably try and close on them. Let's just kind of loop around with the cavalry, and we'll see what our commanders end up doing when they decide that it seems to be worth it. I'm gonna just tell everyone to charge in, actually. It just doesn't seem to be going our way, waiting on this uh, assault. So I'm just gonna distract a little bit. Yeah, that's a ton of crossbowmen. 
Yeah, just come over here, guys. Just go away from my uh, my actual units. And hopefully... Uh, our units stop getting so destroyed because they're getting demolished down there. Okay, here we go. I think we're starting to get in there. Yeah, this, this group of archers needs to go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. There. Oh, I missed. How do you miss that, dude? Okay, I'm just gonna do this for the fun. Go back to the monastery, dude. He had like all those haircuts, in case you're wondering why I said that. It's not as cool when you have to explain the thing that you just said. That was supposed to be all like hardcore. Oh! <laughs> but then you make up with it with things like that. Um, tell you what. listen to the sergeants. I don't know what they're gonna do, but I'm just also, again, kind of curious. I'm gonna try and back up this dude as best as I can. AKA shoot these guys' as forces. Because they're all just being a bunch of meanie poopy faces. The wise man once said. Um, okay. Let's try and catch up to them. Okay, they just destroyed that dude. That was not not cool. There's your horse. Down. I really... Um, I would like to take you out, but I'll take your horse out. I'll take it. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> I like how the AI is smart enough to figure that out, but... Uh, let's see. There we go. Got a good shot off there. Oh, he actually got a hit. Okay, I think we've we've pretty much won this. We took quite a few losses, more than I would like against the caravan. Yeah. But you know. You gotta break some eggs, right? I know that there's some people who have found like some min-maxing ways of taking out caravans, but that's not the way this game was meant to be played. This game was meant to be played having you like bleed for your your victories like losing 10 people that's a good chunk of our our forces honestly i'll take all the prisoners though yeah i know it takes a silver limit but we're literally right by a city it's right there i'll take all that loot sure more horses is also welcome yeah we need to heal up um sell all of them and we'll see what we can do in terms of troops. Uh, blah, blah, blah. The ransom broker over there, that's not who I'm looking for. That guy, I think, right there is the... Yeah. I really don't like you thugs. I wish that I could get some actual just mercenary... More mercenary troops that aren't them. Or, like, there was a easier way to find mercenaries besides just at taverns. Because, like, there's guilds and stuff. And, like, a lot of mods will, will do that. But... We'll see. If they don't add that into the base game, maybe they'll get it later. Yeah, Batania, they'll they won't have a problem with this, not for too long because um, they're not gonna be a nation for very long, <laughs> honestly. So I'll I'll take um, the help where I can get it, and we'll just start raiding. Um, actually, sorry, we didn't unload our trade goods. And we also need to heal up more. Um, we could... Oh, the mules are pretty valuable here. I'll take that. And then... I'm just curious as to what good items we got there. Eh. Whatever. We can get rid of all of it. I love how you can say, hey, like, save this item. It's really cool and it saves a lot of time going through these menus oh man look at our cash okay i i need to look at your toys what what toys do you have for me 
I mean, it's like not even that much money for us at this point. <laughs> Highland Broadsword. Yeah. I'm doing it. And we'll give that to one of our friends. What's your blade? And what's your blade? Yeah. Congratulations. You just got an incredibly overpowered weapon. And then that costs how much? 40,000? What? Why? Okay, that's actually the same shield that I already have, so I'm not going to get that for myself. Um, there's a studded... Oh man, I kind of want it. It's a worse shield. Nah, I, I can't do it. We, we're we in a war where we have to be like totally cutthroat. Um... I might give my companions better bows, though. Para, yeah, you, you can get definitely get a better bow than what you've got. I will... I mean, I could maybe even go for that. I could actually maybe give myself that. No, I've already got um, heavy recurve bow, step recurve bow. They're very similar. Essentially... The step recurve bow is a better bow, but just barely. So just take one of those and equip it. And we're pretty much using all of our money to do this, but I think it's worth it. Yeah, this is totally worth it. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. That's an insane weapon. We're gonna be doing pretty good after this. I think Para. I'm gonna give you the nice new bow that I just got. Um, or not the that's not the new bow. And you have some fancy arrows for me. Range arrows. I think that's the best that they have. Sure. Let's get two range arrows, and then one of them will go there. And the other will go here. And Longbow will switch that out. Actually, we can't really afford to switch it out for now. Well, you're next, though. Don't worry. Don't you worry about a thing. Um, okay. Yeah, I think we've gone and made a lot of enemies here, so no one's going to trade with us. But we can go back down to the Geta and go closer to Sari lands. That might be a good idea. So where are all of these armies? Gar Garantor, that's probably the closest one. Yeah. So if we make our way down that way, that's probably the good move for us right now. It's either that or raiding. I don't think we're going to find villages that we can take with our force right now. We're pretty beat up. Yeah, like, they're 51. We're not going to be able to take that. Not in our state. Uh, let's see. I could try and raid these places. They already hate me. God, they hate me so much, these people. Um, no, nah, we're not going to go for the looters. Not worth it. How many people are defending? 74? Oh, man. If I got, like, another enemy lord that had a good-sized army, I might be able to get them to join me. <sighs> Palatid's army right there. Gotta be careful. Is he gonna pursue me? No, he's not gonna pursue me, right? If I say go over there. No. Oh! If he catches me right now, I'm gonna be very upset. I'm actually going to just quick save because, um, uh, just because I think that he's about to catch me and I'm not okay with that. Yeah. Yeah, no. Um, why are you offering? Nope. I'm not doing this. That, that is totally not cool. I'm loading that back up because... I'm not fighting an army of 200 because the game's not letting me walk over a hill. Not happening. Tell me that I can turn around and get away from them. 
If I need to, I can get rid of some of our troops or something. We'll see. If the, yeah, we're fine. Okay, so let's see. I think that we're okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we're good. We can get away from an army of 200, right? I know that we're hurt, but they're, they can't be that fast. There's no way. There is a caravan right there. It's tempting. Uh, defenders, there's only 16 of them. I think I'm gonna do it. I think I'm gonna raid. I know that they're gonna try and attack a place, but I really don't think that they're gonna be able to take it. Yeah, they're not gonna... <laughs> they're not gonna... <laughs> um, be too happy with me. Uh, I'm also just trying to keep an eye out for parties because there might be some parties that come through that might attack me. Uh, yeah, like that that dude right there. Um, we're going to end our raiding and run away. Or what? Okay, I think... Why are we moving so slow? What's up with our travel speed? We look here. Party speed is disorganized. Wounded members. Uh, I think. I don't know what to do. I don't know how to up our speed enough. I think we might need to just get rid of some of our wounded. Um, if I... Yeah, just get rid of them. Militia Archer, I'd be willing to get rid of you too. You get rid of a expert thug. And then I'm at 4.8. I think that that's fast enough, right? Because they're at 4.7. Yeah, so I think that now we're just about fast enough to get away. <laughs> it is close. Oh, oh, hold on, what? No, that's, again, the game. I'm sorry, I, I just did that, like, just a second ago. Um, but that that was like a misclick of a button. That was not purposeful. Like, I'm all about Iron Mode, and I love playing games Iron Mode style. But if a misclick of a button ends your game, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm not doing that. What? We just got away from you guys. Again, I apologize. This is not... <laughs> not what I would like to be doing right now. Um, we'll get through it. I just kind of jumped the gun and tried to... Uh, tried to be somewhere that we shouldn't be, I guess. Let's go over here. That should give us the distance that we need to get away from you. Right, let, did at least last time. Yes, okay, we're good. Just keep on going. Get away from the Mega Army. And then we'll come back down like we were doing last time. And we'll raid, and I'll be a little bit more cautious this time. I promise. If they catch me this time, maybe I'll just roll with it. We'll, we'll let it go. Okay, that dude... He's probably gonna... No, he's traveling to the castle. Nope, he's he's trying to engage me. What is your speed? 4.7. This is the same dude that I, I just got away from, so I think we'll just do the same thing that we did last time. We'll just get rid of our wounded. I don't know if we're like... Just like, see ya. <laughs> I think that's what's going on. Yeah. We want 4.8 as our speed. I think... Yeah, we got rid of you as well, and now we're at 4.8. That should be fast enough to let me get away from this dude. In theory. If I don't, like, click the spacebar again. Yeah, we'll just hopefully not get ambushed by a smaller, faster party of this faction. Yeah, they're... they're They've lost interest. 
they're defending some castle. Garantor Castle. Oh, is it under siege? Oh, it kind of makes sense that it would be under siege. I am going to see if I can hang out with this dude. I can't just like click like follow or whatever. That's a shame. Well, we're going to see what we can do to help you. Because it looks like you're going to be in a fight right now. And we can take your battle and make it a 2 to 1 ratio. And who doesn't like a 2 to 1 ratio? I know I like a 2 to 1 ratio. There's only one thing better than that. A greater than 2 to 1 ratio. Yep, we are going to help out this Asari dude. And we're going to just destroy this guy. Like, seriously, with a 2 to 1 ratio, I'm just going to tell the sergeants to do what they're going to do. And we'll see how it goes. Yeah, because they should stay within the support of the AI. So I'm going to just kind of stay with the infantry myself. Kind of weird seeing the like the green and the blue on the same map. It looks like it looks like my archers are here. There's 33 of them, and then or no, that's them. So am I the blue then? So am I contributing like anything towards the fight? A couple horses. Kind of confused. That's also like my constant state of being. Oh. Nope, missed that. Ah, uh, missed that too. There we go, we got a hit. No. Yeah, these horsemen are annoying. The horses do go down, eventually. Oh, come on. There we go. Got the Blandian cavalry. Oh man, never mind. Not going in there. Take out the pikemen though. Definitely will uh, help clear up the. Oh no, he's gonna fire at me. Definitely will help uh, clear up the blue, uh, the routers. There we go. See, I love these piercing arrows. They're so good. <laughs> you might not want to bend over there, buddy. Like, honestly, like, those heavily armored troops, like, regular arrows would probably be doing, like, 5 damage to them or something like that. Like, it really doesn't do anything. But, with what we got, we saw, we're doing, like, what was that, 20-something? As I scroll through here, 30, 40 damage. Yeah, like, that's pretty respectable damage. Especially for arrows and heavy armor. It's very good, actually. Just arrived in the nick of time. No, I don't think that's fair. I don't think we arrived just in the nick of time. I think you guys had it under control a little bit better than that. I'm not going to take any prisoners because we need to be nimble right now. Um, let's go to the castle just to see what's going on with that. Oh, what are you doing? Yeah, you've got an army. What are you doing? What's the game plan here? I wish that you could see what they're doing. I mean, I, I know I could easily just join the army. I think that I'm probably more effective raiding. And just being a general nuisance to the, uh, the, the um, Vlandians. And just kind of cutting off their troops. Honestly. Take over command! I kind of... And there's 12 archers. Do I really need to be doing this? I could have honestly just put that on the, the quick one. It would have been fine. Yeah, they're gonna shoot at me any second now. That's okay, I, I can shoot at them. Oh wow, that dude actually uh, just stood a couple shots there. I'm impressed. Oh, come on. Give me that. 
Yeah, I think the key to hitting those shots is slowing down, honestly. Just making your horse, like, pause makes you so accurate. And then if you need to, you can run up. But you don't really need to a lot of the time. And then I can do, like, that. It's always quicker to shoot than to run up to them, you know? Okay, so I think... Given that we've got a crew rolling through up there, ah, I should have probably taken those prisoners and then dropped them off in the castle. I've heard that's a good way of getting renown. Maybe I'll do that if the other militias fight back. Um, we'll actually have time pass. And these people are gonna hate me. They're gonna hate me so much. But at least I'll have some renown. I'm gonna have some serious amounts of cash. Got some dates. Yeah, I think 38 soldiers are, is not going to make much of a difference in the general war effort. So I think that honestly, this is much better use of our time. And it will help out in the long run. Uh, those caravans are looking mighty tempting, but we just don't have the troops. Yeah, that's the problem with being out here and raiding how we're doing is nobody's gonna want to work for us oh those villagers up there i would love to be able to attack them can i finish looting please yes okay good can i cut off those villagers on their way oh no you don't like it when i raid too bad i really don't care that much uh villagers if i can take any of you prisoner I will. I'm going to the market too. We can pay you. I want everything. Yep. You're not paying me. Oh, that's kind of cool though. I like how they've, uh, they've added that in. It's a nice little touch. Sergeant, I heard that out. they're they're more willing to surrender now. I almost listened. But I want the prisoners for the renown, just to kind of see how that works, honestly. I know it's a dumb reason to ruin my name as an honorable man. <laughs> oh, man. Good luck. Good luck. Man, I said that once to Esther and they got so offended. But I mean, it was, it was pretty mean. Because it was like, basically like... Yeah, you're not going to be successful with that, you know? Oh man, those rocks. I hate those rocks. I've seen some memes about the rocks. It seems that other people feel very similar about that. Okay, yep, let's, uh, let's be done with it. I know it's not even one renown. I'm going to take those peasants. Just because I kind of want to drop them off in the castle and see how this works. Yeah, go to the castle. I'm kind of interested in following our um, donate, uh, not to the garrison though, we're done, um, go to the dungeon, donate prisoners, man these two, these dudes are just like some peasants, do I get any renown from that, I didn't even look at the menu, I went through it too fast, uh, Garmadan I can go loot. How many people do I actually have in my party? There's nine more that are wounded. So I could recruit some more. Uh, let's go back to Koyaz. I think that that's probably a good call, is getting uh, just a little bit stronger. Oh my gosh. They're besieging Legata with 600. I am uh, I'm right behind you. I will come to Legata. And see if we can actually take a city from the Vlandians. I don't think we will. But it's it's worth trying, you know. Uh, we'll see about getting some more recruits. Come on. There we go. Yep. And let's see if the people in uh, in town if they've got some recruits for me. They do. Hey, we've got a Mamluk soldier as well. 
Am I 58 out of 74? Yeah, we're way under capacity. Um, let's just go then and get some troops. I would like more than just um, anybody. But I'll take anybody at this point. And I might want to get some more horses because that I think will speed us up even more. Yeah, let's just get we'll get some more horses. Um maybe at one of these villages if they trade in it. No, they don't. Okay. Maybe we'll get them at the city. We do want to basically boost our numbers as much as the game will let me. Um for this uh the siege. Even if these guys are just like blank bodies for the siege. Uh, maybe I should buy some fish here, too. That probably would be a good thing, right? Um, footman on horses. I think we, yeah, we need to get more, uh, more horses. It's just actually, I, I did say I was going to get some fish here. Just get some fish. And I'm going to sell you a bunch of stuff. And hopefully that will actually get me access to better recruits. Because I think I remember hearing something about that um, way back. And, oh, look at that hardwood. That sells for quite a bit. And that iron ore does too. Um, I don't know if that's a good deal on the grapes, but I'm going to sell some. Oh, never mind. How much money do you have? Do you not have money? So if I... I Probably want to take back... Let's just buy more fish then. Hold on, what's, what's the hold up here? Oh, they just like straight up just don't have like very much money at all. Let's just give them all that. And then I'll buy back some fish. Uh, I think they're happy with that. Cool. And then we're going to go get more horses and make our way up to Legata, I think, was the game plan, right? Uh, yeah, we need mercenaries right now, so that's that's a good thing. Oh, look, I think that there's a new uh, companion there, so maybe there's some more units for us to recruit here. Thugs. Sure, I'll take thugs. Not my first choice, but I'll take them. And no recruits. Wow, you actually like us quite a bit there. Um, we were going to trade and get horses, right? I forgot about that. Um, what horses do you have? And some Sturgeon Trotters. I'll take those. I'll take actually like pretty much all of those. Even the desert horses are a pretty good deal here. And does that make me go faster? Um, yeah, I think it does actually, but I'm just, if we look at that, oh, actually, yeah, that's making me go even faster. Good. I'll do that. I've heard at a certain point you don't go actually faster, but we're not at that point, so we don't have to worry about that. And I do realize that we've been going way over our half an hour limit, but I just like, I know if I don't get to the Gata, I'm going to forget that they were going to go siege that. And it's kind of weird that they're going to the Gata and not this place, but maybe the Gata has like a, a weaker group. Oh, is there a siege actually happening here right now? <gasps> I think there is. Oh man, well, we're going to have to start attacking that in the next episode. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.